hello everyone welcome back to another vlog i'm starting in the car again but it is memorial day and it's kind of crazy i'm at the hermosa beach pier about to go to lunch with one of my friends caitlin but as you can imagine it is craziness right now at the pier i weirdly found parking i hope that i don't get towed because you know how parking signs are all crazy but yeah, hopefully we will be okay, but hello if you're new here to the channel. My name is Vivian. I share food and style inspo and obviously vlogs. So today should be a relaxing day. I think the last time I checked in with you guys was just over the weekend. There wasn't really much to do. As always, if you guys like what you see, then please hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so you can be notified every time I post a new video. I will also show you guys my outfit in a second. Just this white outfit, like a linen outfit that I have actually from my previous fashion video. So go check that out. Like the Memorial Day spring style outfit inspiration. So go check that out, but I'll have everything linked down in the description box as usual. But without further ado, let's get on out there and head on to our yummy lunch. I know. you guys um i think the last time i checked in with you guys was like before lunch and i think i took like b-roll of the rest of the day but oh my gosh i actually kind of like died a little bit i don't know what happened but i got like really sick and i started feeling super lightheaded and dizzy like i was gonna pass out which usually doesn't happen unless i'm like super drunk which i wasn't but Honestly, I think at this point, I feel like there's this pattern of like, if I walk after I drink, it like accelerates my drunkenness or something. I don't know. But I literally, in the middle of the Hermosa Pier, felt like I was going to pass out. And like in the middle of meeting Caitlin's parents, I had to just like stop and just be like, I need to like sit down. Or else I, was just, I felt like I was just going to like literally like pass out like right then and there in the middle of the pier. So... I literally just like was a little sloth and just was like sitting at this little thing that Caitlin found for me to sit at sweating up a storm and just like tried to regain myself again so that was kind of intense but I felt like I needed to redeem myself so um on the way back walking to my car I was like you know what I'm gonna grab a lemonade and then I saw the popcorn stand and I'm like you know what I'm gonna grab popcorn too so yeah that was so weird I I ate before too and I don't feel tired so I'm kind of like what is happening but anyways happy memorial day to you guys I mean by the time you guys see this this is like a week late but happy belated memorial day to you guys now I'm back home and honestly that little experience kind of took me out for the count so I'm just gonna chill here and watch some shows and enjoy my popcorn and lemonade that I picked up because now I just like don't feel like doing anything for the rest of the day um, but I will check in with you guys later on in the vlog so I'll see you guys then oh actually I forgot the whole reason why I even came on back on here because I needed to show you guys my outfit so here is the outfit in full so here's what I wore. This is like a variation of the linen outfit from the Memorial Day or like spring style fashion video that I just posted. So go check that out. But here is the whole look. Just like cropped tank pants, linen top, raffia slides, and then with the bag like this. Ta -da. And then this is where I have like that button to make these larger pants fit better. Some sunnies. Here's the whole look. All right, now for real, I'm gonna relax for the rest of the day and I will check in with you guys later on in the vlog. Good morning, everyone. Today I'm actually starting off, well, again, in the car. I've been starting off in the car for a bit, but I'm actually working like in person with my team today. I work from home, like everything's remote, but um, I think like once a quarter, we're gonna decide to like be together and work together in person. So we're just at a cute little cafe in San Clemente. I don't know how much I'm gonna record of the day. I'll try to show you guys, but without further ado, let's hurry up and get started with our work day. Hi 
Hi, so it is the next day. I think the last time I checked in with you guys was yesterday when I was going home or like still working like in person with my team. So had a good work day. Um, it just took a long time to get back home. I was like in the thick of traffic on the 405 back to LA. So yeah, that was not fun, but it was fine. I listened to the Real Housewives of New Jersey reunion part one, like in the car like a podcast and oh my goodness by the way speaking of reunions are any of you guys into like vanderpump rules i made like a goat cheese ball recipe so go check out my food playlist on my channel but i love vanderpump rules i'm obsessed i feel like everyone's talking about it but i kind of feel like the new jersey's reunion was like giving more in part one than part two and one combined for vanderpump so i don't know we'll see how part three is but Anyways, I am heading over to our friend's baby's first birthday party. They're just having it at uh, one of these like local restaurants here. So I'm about to head in. I'm not going to bring the big camera. I don't know if I'm going to record a lot, but I'll check back in with you guys afterwards and then I'll show you guys what else I'm doing for the rest of the day. But I will obviously have my dress linked down below. It's just a really pretty like floral um, Amazon dress that I've had for a while. And it's also linked in my Amazon storefront, but I'll have it linked down in the description box too if you guys want to shop it. But yeah, let's head on over and have a wholesome little family day. guys yesterday and then i just like so tired of the rest of the day that i just chilled but it was really really fun and wholesome just like so many kids everywhere the babies were so cute and yeah it was really fun we had this little activity where like in korean culture i don't know what it's called but i'm sure other cultures have this where like you make the baby pick from an array of items like i think i picked a pencil there's like I think you could pick like, put like a fruit or like an apple or something if they're gonna like be a good eater, stuff like that. But nowadays, people get like more modern with it. So the dad is into golf. So he put like a golf ball in there, a little golf girly, which she ended up picking that. So that was really fun. And then everyone voted on like what they thought she was gonna pick. So the winners um, got to be chosen from the little golf ball voters. I chose the gavel. Like, you know, the little thing that the judge bangs on. <laughs> Just because I figure like a lot of people were like strategizing, like what's going to be like the biggest, most colorful thing that the baby is going to like be attracted to. Everyone else voted for other stuff. So I was like, okay, let me do the gavel. But yeah, that was a cute little activity, but that was really fun. And then today we do have a couple more things planned. We have... Um, an appointment at Groom's Grotto, which I'll talk more about in my bridal series, which I think I'm going to release starting this week. So I'm so excited. Be on the lookout for that. We have like an appointment to custom make Wes's suit for all of the events this year. So, so excited for that. I'll show you guys what that looks like. And then we have my dad's birthday dinner. He's turning 60. So we're just going to do that and then hang out with the cats for the rest of the day. So, um, yeah, my dress, you guys have seen this for forever. This is just like this crew neck sweater dress that you guys have seen before. So I'll link this down in the description box. But just in case I don't check in with you guys before the vlog ends, thank you guys so much for watching. Please stick around and watch the rest of the vlog because I'm planning to show you guys um, like what Groom's Garden looks like and then a little bit of dinner. I just want to say thank you guys so much for watching. There's quite a few new subscribers here. So thank you guys so much for being here and following me along on this journey. Whether you're here for the fashion, the food, the bridal stuff, or just life in general, I appreciate you. So thank you so much and I hope you enjoy the rest of the vlog.